Hello and a warm welcome to the Donbass Arena, this vast venue in Donetsk. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And this should be a fascinating confrontation from the group stage of the UEFA Champions League. It is Shakhtar Donetsk taking on Real Madrid. Well, I think this should be a good game tonight, Derek. We've got some excellent players on show here. Let's just hope they perform to their best. This is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Fernand Mendy starts with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And beginning the game up front today, Karim Benzema. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Good bit of pressing. And that's an important intervention. It's there for him, and he struck the post. And a goal it is. The keeper really not part of the equation. Well, just take another look at this because he reacts so well, and he then keeps his composure. It's a good finish. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Well, I must say it's a nice position to be in. First place already guaranteed for the visitors. They can just go out there and enjoy the football. Yeah, they've cruised to top spot, haven't they? Should mean they avoid the tougher teams in the first knockout round. If they weren't already, they have to be one of the favourites now. Good-looking ball. There could be a chance now. Stepanenko mastery of the passing game really high class goalkeeping from Courtois spot on with that tackle and he read it well defensively Benzema Possession and patience, the watchwords. Plays it back. Could be threatening. 
Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, it still could be dangerous. Manor Solomon. It's with Matt Vienko. Tete. Solomon. Real chance. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Let's see about the delivery. Well, the danger is still there. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, seeing from him here. Well, he's had a great competition so far. His finishing has been so clinical, and these defenders just can't afford to give him any sort of space in the box. Otherwise, they'll be punished. Tete on the ball, Taras Stepanenko almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Well, that could be the final warning. Well, he needs to be careful now. Next foul, and it's a card. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Tete. Really getting stuck in. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Benzema. Now, Eder Militao. Casemiro. This is Kroos. Vinicius Jr. Benzema waiting. Not an attempt that will live long in the memory. Well, what a waste that is. It's far too easy for the keeper. Real find themselves in a position of menace. Couldn't hang on to the ball. And Real come away with it. Dicing with a bit of danger here. Oh, what's he gone and done? Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. And he's in. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping.
playing it in and a struggle to get it away properly well read to put an end to that attack this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity Asensio Benzema waiting oh, simply couldn't beat the first defender and a goal update to bring you from the San Siro Alex Scott has that for us it's a goal for Inter it's now 2-1 with 41 minutes on the clock the game has been fascinating so far, Derek. Many thanks, Alex. Junior Moraes. Can they take advantage? And he was in the right place to intercept. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Karim Benzema. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Benzema of course here's Modric well the keeper had a lot of ground to cover splendid save Trying to deliver it accurately. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Luka Modric normally bosses the game from his midfield position. But it's not happening so much in this game, Stuart. Well, he's been poor today. He hasn't got on the ball enough. He's given it away cheaply and he's been outplayed. That's the main reason why they're losing at the moment. Underway then in the second half of this Champions League group stage confrontation. Solomon, a sloppy in possession. Vinicius Jr. Superb block. Course. And back with Vinicius. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Dodo Tete now with Junior Moraes delightful pass well it was close but offside nonetheless well it's a matter of inches there but he just went a fraction too early Right place to cut out the pass. Now can they create something? Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Casemiro. On to Benzema. Oh, a lovely ball. And it's in! Beyond the goalkeeper, Real Madrid on level. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. So back underway. One goal apiece here.
making progress. But a good piece of defence. Now well, far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Well, it's been such a good game so far. Chances and goals at both ends, and all played at a great tempo. It's certainly been a good watch. Benzema. Well read to put an end to that attack. Junior Moraes. Top-class defending. Modric. Struggling to keep the ball. Tete. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And the decision offside here. Carvajal Asensio A goal here Giving his team precisely what they were looking for Now he deserves to celebrate it Well here's the replay And he shows great awareness to play this through ball And the timing of the run is just as good As for the finish It was never in doubt is here Junior Morais Karim Benzema Tony Kroos Oh he's really up on the map here turn out to be the two-punch knockout well here's the replay he's done well to get his head up pick out a teammate and from there he never looked like missing that's a lovely goal Underway again with the score at 3-1. And news of a goal at the San Siro. Alex Scott can fill us in. It's a goal for Inter. It's now 3-1 with 72 minutes played. The game has been fascinating so far, Derek. Many thanks, Alex. Junior Moraes. Mano Solomon. And space for the cross. And routine for the keeper in the end. The cross far too close to him. Vinicius Junior. Mendy. He's given it straight to the opposition. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Dodo on to Junior Moraes well couldn't keep it and he could be in and the alarm bells are ringing and it's in they've eaten into their advantage and this is not over not yet anyway 
Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. Well, the game has been restarted. 3-2 here. Mendy. Is with Vinicius Junior. Federico Valverde. Casemiro failed to hang on to it. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left. And the margin, just one. The sound of it, somebody has scored at the San Siro, but who exactly? Alex can tell us. It's another goal for Inter. It's now 4-2 with 86 minutes on the clock. Alex, thank you very much. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Substitution time it is here. Stepanenko. Super save, and they stay in the lead. That's a big save and a big moment. He's just won them the game here. He's driven in the corner. And he takes it on. Tremendous block. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Who can they pick out? And a harmless cross gobbled up. And now it is truly final. The match is over. Luka Modric tends to bring a calm authority to any game. How would you sum up what he produced? Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.